Welcome back. Today we're going to use Final Cut Pro to demonstrate making a professional video that you can use for your own business or a client business. All you need is some existing photos. We'll take those and make a move. Just like they're a video, it's going to be very professional. I'm going to show you our end result here in a minute. So what you're going to learn, there's four or five different things we're going to learn in Final Cut Pro with this. So I'm going to break it down into four or five videos so it doesn't get overly complicated. Because once you know these elements, then it's really simple to get it done. So like I said, all you need are some photos. Now what we're going to do is cover three different tools in Final Cut Pro. That's one element. The next element is we're going to cover how to resize your photographs. The next element is we're going to show you how to make those photos move using the Ken Burns effect. And there's different ways to do that. So I'm going to get you started, and then you're going to be able to use that understanding to build on it. We're also going to show you how to do cropping. We're going to show you how to do transitions in Final Cut Pro. I have some free ones and some ones I paid for, but it's important to understand how they work. So we're going to, that's another element. Another element is music. Got to have some music in there. So we'll add some music. I'll show you where you can get some free music. And, uh, because that, you know, when you, you'll see when you have music in your videos, it really does take it up a notch. And the last thing is, the last element is branding. You're going to make sure that you do some branding in your video because when your viewer is done watching your video, you want them to remember you or you want them to remember your client. So those are the different elements. I hope you enjoy the video. Let's get this uh, end result started so you can see what you're going to be making. And uh, if you like what you see here, I'm hoping that you're going to be a subscriber. I hope that you like the video, and I hope to see you at the next video. There's a link in the text below this video to get to the next one. It's part two.